Coop, the summer grind of football camp, I remember two a days used to kill me. <laughs> yeah. Lugging that water on the field, all those towels for the players. You know, I was the H2O boy. <laughs> uh, you were the quarterback? <laughs> yeah, no. Well, was, you know, I'll tell you I, something. I was about, a water boy. I'll tell you something. You know, Arizona has become a it hotbed has. for high school quarterbacks here in the state. I mean, already seven have committed or have, yeah, committed to Division I colleges already. And part of that's great coaching. It, it is. And, and let me tell you about one. Dan Manucci, he's a co-host of the Rock and Manucci Show weekdays on NBC Sports Radio. Afterwards, he puts on a cape, if you will, and becomes a quarterback whisperer. Manucci was a quarterback at McClintock High in Tempe, collegiately at Kansas State, and in the NFL with the Buffalo Bills. Listen up, pop up, pop back, read step right, settle, and then throw on the run. For over 20 years, Dan Manucci has offered his expertise to aspiring young quarterbacks. Use that body, get that shoulder down through the ball, guys. For weekday nights plus the weekends, Manucci is working with youngsters of all ages from all over the state. Keep your wit. Good. My whole goal is number one, just, just to, is to is not only work with them with their mechanics, their throwing, uh, showing up on time, mentoring them to understand what it's all about to be a quarterback on and off the field. PJ London is the starting quarterback for Blue Ridge High School in Pine Top. He and his parents have made that four hour drive every week for the last three years to take part in Manucci's quarterback school. Commitment, it is every weekend. We drive down here at 4.30 in the morning. When he's committed to it, it makes it easier to roll out of bed. And actually, when the sun's coming up, the drive's beautiful. Since I've been here, he's been so much help, and like, I don't think I'd want to go to anyone else. Ty Thompson is a starting quarterback for Mesquite High School in Gilbert. He's been offered by more than a dozen colleges, including ASU. Yeah, so I started with him in, I think, sixth grade. So I'm going to be in 11th, so five years now. Um, so I just, I just see myself growing so much as a quarterback. I uh, spin the ball way better now. Not only was he showing him how to do it right, but showing, how to, showing him how to be a, a good young man. Nathan Clayton has been coming to Manucci's quarterback school since his fifth grade year. He graduated from Tempe High last year and is attending a prep school in Texas. Obviously something's working, otherwise I wouldn't have come back after a certain amount of time. It's just what he's done is has worked and it's been proven in the guys that he has in college and the guys he has in the NFL. And that's my goal is to make it to that top level and so you got to work with the best to become the best. I'm very, very proud of what these young men do. Not, not for me, Coop. It, it's about them. It's about those young men taking all that they've learned here, taking that to the football field with their coaches, and then expounding on that. All right. If you missed any part of the story or would like to share it with a friend, simply log on to our new 12 News app.